Welcome back, little beans. Warning, the following ASMR is only aimed for beans who are in need for comfort and positive energy from a favorite anime character. There won't be any NSFW versions of this ASMR. This is for all ages and is appropriate for all. However, if you feel uncomfortable from videos like this, then click off. To the ones who are staying, go right ahead and get all cozy in your blinkies, pop in your headphones, snack on some pockies, and enjoy this ASMR. Oh, I can't believe class is over. Oh my neck, that test, I must have aced it. What do you think, Leorio? Of course you're gonna ace it. I mean, you've been studying for like, ever since the last project. I gotta get it done, Kurapika! It's becoming a habit! <laughs> Whatever you say. Hey, have you seen Gon and Kilua and Listener? Oh, I think they have PE together. I think they're coming out right now. Mm. I mean, it is lunchtime, so... Maybe I'll go choose a table for all of us, and you can go find them. I mean, aren't you dating Listener? Of course you have to go find your girlfriend. You know what? You're right. Maybe somewhere outside. It's a really beautiful day. Uh, I wouldn't think that could up, because... What do you mean? It's raining. Oh. Maybe somewhere by the, the window. That actually is, it's very, sounds very peaceful. Alright, window it is. Well, can I go down there? See you in a bit, Kurapika! See you, Leorio. Oh, oh, there they are. Looks like I don't need to go all the way down there. And then I said to Pito, why are you running? And it turns out he was just afraid of me. Yeah, I think ever since you accidentally pushed him against Dodgeball, he's been afraid of you ever since. H how can you be afraid of me? I'm too kind! There he is! Hi, Pito! Uh, I wonder what's wrong with him. It was just dodgeball. You legit punched him in the face with the dodgeball! I didn't mean to. Yeah, listener, you're right. I mean, Pito, he, he's just a very fragile guy. The one time he dressed up like a cat. I don't know, it's just a phase. Hey, look, it's Kurapika. Oh, hey, Kurapika! Oh, hey. I was going to look for you guys and head down there, but looks like you're already up here. Now we got out a little early. Yeah, we were doing the pacer, and then after that we just do whatever we want. Me and Kilo, we were just playing basketball. Well, what were you doing, listener? Oh yeah, you were just finishing up homework. Yeah, that's what we were doing. Oh, I am not excited for the pacer. Oh boy. You can do it, Kurapika. Yeah, I know you can do it! <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> what was that, listener? <laughs> oh, you're such a flirt. You, you just have such a dirty mind. Anyways, Leorio just picked a table for us so that we can all have lunch together. How about we head down there, right? Okay! I hope it's by the window. It is by the window. Sweet. I wonder what's for dessert. Mm, I heard it's either cupcakes or brownies. Oh! Hell yeah! Well, come on. Let's head down there. Let's hold hands, sweetie. Mm, I even heard we have a very healthy lunch. Like a grilled chicken s salad. Maybe with some Caesar or Italian. What is up with you with salads? I thought it was pizza. No, that was, that was yesterday. No, I think it's on Friday. I think it's spaghetti. Well, I'm having spaghetti. Mm, you need to watch your diet, Kilua. I'm fit! I mean, <laughs> look at Avery. I mean, she always likes it when I work out. Doesn't matter what I eat, as long as I'm working out and have those abs. She is crazy for them. Uh, okay. Oh, there's Leorio. He picked a really good spot. Yeah, we can see the rain in the whole school. Technically the gym. Well, the field, technically. It's a very lovely view. <laughs> Again, Leorio with the homework. I have two more to do today. It's the final semester and just want to get caught up, Kurapika. Okay, just leave me be. I want to make my mom proud for me. Okay, you do you. Well, me and Listen are going to get some lunch. 
going, Kilo? Do you need anything, or do you already have your lunch? Oh, Aunt Mito made my lunch. Yeah, I, I, I got myself some lunch, too. All right, I'll bring back some brownies for you guys, okay? All right, thank you! Sweet. I can't wait for some brownies. You have a thing for sugar. It's good. Huh? What is it, sweetie? Huh. You mean him? What? What's wrong with him? Uh, uh, why are you being... Are you okay? Oh, uh, okay. Um, you can go sit back down. I can get your lunch. Of course. Go ahead, sit back down. I mean, you, you've been working out, so I'll go get it for you. Mm-hmm. Huh? Oh, listener, you're sitting back without your food? Oh, Kurabika's gonna get it for you. Okay. Is there something the matter? You look quite scared. And a little uncomfortable. It's okay, you can tell us, listener. Huh? Listen, Leorio! Listener's not looking too well! Wait, really? What happened to you, listener? Is everything okay? Did someone hurt you? Uh, no? Well, good. Because I will legit punch their faces if they ever hurt you! What? Someone's been harassing you? For how long? Three weeks? And he didn't stop? Who is this person? We need to report this. Or if Kurapika finds this out, you do not want to see when he's angry. What are you guys talking about? Kurapika! Listener's being harassed by someone! I'm sorry, what? Who's been harassing you, baby? Who? Whoever it is, I will beat the living crap out of them just for you, just to make them stop. Calm down, Kurapika! Dude, that is actually really scary! Oh my god! But seriously, who is this guy that's harassing you, listener? Yeah, we need to know who it is! Hmm, let me guess. Is it Tompa? No. Hmm, is it Pito? Okay, good. Hmm. I know who it is. Really? Who is it? It's Phaeton! No, not him. Hmm. I ran out of ideas. Hold on. What about Crollo? Whoa, not even Crollo? Hmm. Huh? Wait, really? Dude, not him! Sweetie. Why didn't you tell me about this? What has he been doing to you? Don't be afraid. Why? Yeah, why? He's been passing you notes? He's trying to ask you out, and you keep rejecting him, and he keeps going on and on? Dude, he needs to know that no means no. Plus, she's already cut up because girl. Dude, I would never do that. I mean, ever since I asked out Avery, yeah, we were really close. Yeah, he needs to know that no means no. Wait, what? He's been touching your thigh under the table. Uh, could I be good? Your eyes are turning scarlet. I think we should leave. Where is he, listener? Where is he? Yeah, where is that jackass? Uh, I think he's over there. Where, Gone? He's over there. Oh, I see him. Don't worry, baby. We'll take good care of him just for you. Yeah. Come on, boys. Let's go over to that jackass. Hell yeah, we're gonna teach him a lesson. Hello, mister. <laughs> oh, don't mind us. We just wanted to have a little chat with you. Yeah, and we got something to say. You leave listener alone! Yeah, she's been telling us that you've been, you know, harassing her. You really don't take no as an answer? 
bro, bro, she may not be my sister, but legit, I will beat the living crap out of you if you don't keep your creepy hands off of her. Seriously, she's not into you. She will never be into you. Yeah, you're nothing but an incel. What's an incel? I'll explain later, Gone. Oh, so you're not gonna listen, huh? Well, get this. If you keep laying a hand on my listener, if you still don't take no as an answer, I will legit hunt you down, chain you to the bathroom stalls, and leave you there. Now, are you gonna take no as an answer? Or do you just wanna learn the hard way? You better. Because we are her protectors. Yeah. You do not want to mess with us. Especially me. You see these claws right here? They're sharper than blades. Cut you up like paper. And you don't want to mess with me either. I can punch your face beating from rock, paper, scissors. You don't want to see that, do you? And if you keep going over her, Still not taking no as an answer. I'll show you rock. Same with me. Because you're screwed. It's four against one. Are you going to give up now? Then apologize to her. Go on. Do it. Apologize to listener for what you've done. Good. Well... Looks like we got everything settled. Again, if you keep harassing her, we're coming after you. Yeah! Run, you pussy! Kilua, watch it. I'm just saying. I mean, he is one. But I, sh I prefer a scaredy cat. Yeah, that's another word for that. Uh, uh, <laughs> oh, th you're welcome, listener. Anything for you? Of course! Why didn't you tell us sooner that this guy was harassing you? Of course we would have been there for you. We'd be, we'd be beating his ass up. But hey, we got him taken care of. And now, he won't be harassing you anymore. Because we got you back. Oh, you're very welcome, listener. We would do anything for you because we love you. Even though I love you more. Dang, Kurapika. You're even more of a simp than Hizoka. At least I'm not thirsty all the time. Wait until you go to the pacer! Don't even r remind me. <laughs> well, looks like we can all enjoy our lunch now. Oh my god! Uh, guys, I forgot to get your brownies. You what? Well, don't worry, there's still more! Let's go get some, because I really need a brownie. Me too, I think we all deserve a brownie! For our hard works from protecting a listener. Mm. Do you want a brownie too, listener? All right, we can go get some. Come on, boys. Okay. Come on, listener, you can come with us. Yeah, we'll be your protectors and make sure no other guy touches you or talks creepy towards you. Mm-hmm. Only I can do that to you. Ah! We're boyfriend and girlfriend, Kilua. Oh, don't worry, I do that with Avery sometimes. Hey, look, it's Pito! Hi, Pito! Are you getting a brownie, too? Uh... Uh... Meow! Okay, that was awkward. Nah, forget about him. He'll, he'll get over it. I hope so. Oh, boy, look at them brownies. All right, let's head back to the table. Let's enjoy our lunch. Well, here's to us for saving listener. Yeah, like musketeers. Like superheroes. Yeah, kind of like superheroes. Yeah! yeah.